Trinidad and Tobago. What is this light over darkness that we're talking about in this in this wonderful time of Diwali? You know what is light over darkness? Light over darkness is not some flowery language and all niceties. Light over darkness means fighting against oppression. Light over darkness means standing up for the oppressed, standing up for justice, standing up for what is right. That is what light over darkness means. How oh, you think light over darkness, light going and come just so over darkness? Darkness is an evil thing. Darkness is something you have to fight against. That is what light over darkness means. So when people are talking about Diwali Naga and what happened to Diwali Gana, Naga with TTT, intentionally, I don't care what anybody say, in TTT intentionally cut the feed so people of China and Tobago, not only, not only the indo Burgundians, the people of China and Tobago couldn't hear the opposition leader. That is darkness. And we have to fight against that. So how the the Wali Naga, the NCIC, how in the, on earth they can have somebody who every chance he got in the last nine years called Kamna Prasad Bisasa, the first Hindu, first Indo Trinbegonian Prime Minister, female. Every chance he get, he call her a Jamet or worse. How on earth you all can invite that man to come and speak now to indo Trinbegonian peoples, a lot of them females. I don't understand it. I know, according to us, God said, be ye with the oppressed and be not of the oppressors. I do understand. So I realized something. The knife and fork Indians, just like the black bourgeoisie, the they have an indo Trinbegonian bourgeoisie class who are facilitators of the PNM. Just like I have the black bourgeoisie class facilitators of the PNM. Who don't care if black people oppress. Because I'm fighting against oppression for, of African people for the longest while. South African apartheid, apartheid in, from the Israeli Zionists. I fight against the oppression in Lebanon for African I fight, I fight against oppression. Now, I will stand up for whoever is being oppressed. And if that be indo Chinbegonians, I standing up for them. So I'd say to my indo Chinbegonian people, the rank and file, not the knife and fork Indian, who never come out and defend Kamala Prasad Bisasa when Rowley calling her Jamet for all, when she asking questions in the interest of China and Tobago, they never come out and defend her. But quick to go to anything and invite anybody. So I am saying to my people, indo Begonians, afro Begonians, whoever in that Diwali Naga tonight, whenever Christopher Rowley come out to talk, everybody get out, get up and walk out. Let Rowley talk to empty chairs. Show him that indo Begonians will not be bullied. Show him that the people of China and Tobago will not be bullied. You can't, you have to stop talking this flowery talk about light over darkness without knowing what it means. It means standing up to bullies, standing up against oppression, standing up against injustice. So just like how they cut the feed, you all use your conscience and make sure and send that message to keep Christopher Rowley. When he comes to speak, Everybody get up, everybody, I don't care who in the audience, everybody get up and send that message and walk out. Let Rowley talk to empty chairs. Let him know his bullying will not be tolerated. For everybody else, Shubh Diwali, love in your house all the time.